Hey folks, welcome back. Today I want to show you how you can select your data using React Query. So don't waste time and let's jump in it. The goal of this content is to create a list filter by the user ID if you click in the My To Do tab. To that we have to work in the Use To Do's hooks. So first of all, we can create a new use state called Use Filter and uh, it's a set uh, use filter and uh, this uh, state accept a number or, uh, or null in this case uh, if uh, the value is null the, there isn't a filter otherwise there is uh, the ID of the, the user then we can create a function called filter to do by assigny and we can use the use callback to, uh, use callback to create uh, this function this function accept a list of to do and check if the user filter is not defined, return all the, all the to-do, otherwise return the, the list of to-do uh, filter by assigny in this case. And uh, the use callback uses as dependency the user filter uh, state. Then use query expose a configuration called select. This uh, select is uh, a function that uh, uh, accept one, uh, one parameter, a list of to-do in this case, and uh, you can do uh, whatever you want in this, uh, in this function. In our case, we filter the, the to-dos by assigny. It's important this part of the select is, um, is run uh, after the, the, the fetch method, or in this case, uh, the fetch by an HTTP or something uh, something like uh, that, uh, an HTTP request, a GraphQL request, and so on. And then uh, to complete uh, the, the flow, we have to expose the set user filter. In this way, uh, the user can set the filter in the component. For instance, in our case, uh, I create a change view in, uh, in the list, and this change view is a use callback that accept a value. In this case, the value uh, is uh, the current view, uh, all to do or my to do, and uh, check if the value is my to do, uh, set the user ID to the current user ID, otherwise uh, set the user ID to null. Then use the set user filter exposed by the use to do to set the user ID filter, and then change the um, uh, the tab to uh, show the, um, the light in the right uh, tab in this case. So now it's time to see the result in the browser. Okay, now if I click in my to-do, you can see the application filter the, the data. If I click again in uh, all to-do, uh, you can see all the data. Double check, if I go in the React Query Dev Tool, in the to-do query, we can see uh, there, is, uh, th there are four items. In this case, uh, to do one, to do uh, two, to do three, and test. Only the, the to do three uh, has an assignee the, with ID one, my current uh, user. And when I click uh, my to do, uh, the application show only the to do three to do. And uh, simple, no? easy peasy. Okay, that's all from this content. I hope uh, now you have understand how you can use the select uh, option in a red query and uh, I hope you enjoyed it uh, to filter your data in your application. I hope you enjoy this content and if you like it, please hit the like button below. And if you want to stay updated with my content, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you and see you soon. Bye bye.